There were questions over De Gea's role in both goals, particularly the second, as he seemed to allow the German strikes to go in rather easily. After the game, former United captain Keane blasted the Spaniard and gave his advice on what the club should target in the summer window. United have got to get a new goalkeeper, Keane exclaimed. They need a world-class striker and a new goalkeeper. They need some other players and some strength in depth but they need a new goalkeeper and a world-class striker. I'm sick of saying it. Former Arsenal striker Ian Wright agreed and said, they need to at least get a goalkeeper. We've seen some big mistakes from him this season and they need to at least get a goalkeeper that's going to push him. So if he is going to make those mistakes they have someone who can come in and then they can have their turn. Wright was particularly critical over De Gea's role in City's winning goal. Gundogan's volley was struck into the ground, with no real pace on it, but still beat the Spaniard. He's made a lot of mistakes, Wright continued. But it's the kind of shot that is bouncing two or three times before it's got to him which says his positioning may not have been right in the first place. Keane then continued his analysis. He said, that's the thing with top goalkeepers, they get you over the line in certain games and could have been the difference today. You expect your keeper to save that and he didn't and that's why we're seeing these celebrations. For Man United, they need a world-class goalkeeper and he isn't. Keane continued his criticisms but this time with the spine of the United team, which appeared to crumble under the pressure at Wembley. We saw it again today, he said. We've seen lads coming off the bench but they're not good enough. Keane continued his criticisms but this time with the spine of the United team, which appeared to crumble under the pressure at Wembley. We saw it again today, he said. We've seen lads coming off the bench but they're not good enough.